the overclocked Adreno 650 outperforms the Snapdragon 888 chipsets Adreno 660 in performance tests. After the release of the Snapdragon 888 mobile chipset, many people began to reproach Qualcomm for the poor thermal characteristics of the new product. While it offers significant improvements over its predecessor, the Snapdragon 865, its stable performance leaves much to be desired. A senior member of the XDA community, Astronomy 2021, overclocked the Snapdragon 865 Adreno 650 GPU to 940 Hz, which is almost twice the base frequency of 587 MHz. Overclocking along with OpenGL 604 drivers allowed the GPU to outperform the Snapdragon 888 chipset Adreno 660 in a wide range of real-world and synthetic benchmarks, such as in 2.2, 3D Mark Wildlife, Xbench, and Genshin Impact. The best part is that the Adreno 650 consumed an average of 7.2 watts at peak loads while the Adreno 660 consumed up to 11 watts. The resulting performance of the Snapdragon 865 over the Snapdragon 888 serves as a reminder of the latter's shortcomings. Many blame the Samsung N5 process technology on which the chipset is based, which is true, since the same problems occur with the Exynos 2100 with similar characteristics. The Snapdragon 865 was the latest Qualcomm chipset to use TSMC's 7 nanometers process, and it's a testament to the Taiwanese chipmaker's superiority. If we talk about the devices that were compared in the tests, they were Xiaomi Mi 10T based on Snapdragon 865 and Asus ROG Phone 5 based on Snapdragon 888. You can learn more about the testing process in this XDA forums thread.